Hello, and welcome to this presentation on energy efficient solutions for offline LED lighting and general illumination. We hope the information in this presentation will help you meet your design goals. ST holds a unique position in the market and is able to provide a superior level of technical support for your LED applications in offline LED lighting and general illumination. This results from our ability to leverage our position as the number one semiconductor supplier in the lighting segment and number two supplier in power management. In addition, we have built a strong knowledge base to provide many system solutions that use our know-how, including technology integration and innovation with our microcontrollers, smart power devices, LED drivers, and discrete ICs. Our expertise also allows us to provide the excellent technical support our customers expect. In this presentation, we will discuss our offline LED solutions that are used in many different general illumination applications, such as residential and commercial lighting and street lighting. We describe the features and benefits of these solutions, along with the available product and system evaluation boards and tools. ST offers integrated and highly energy efficient solutions in isolated and non-isolated topologies with high power factors and efficiency for the main AC-DC power ranges, satisfying the diversified needs of the offline and general illumination LED lighting market. For up to 10 watt applications, the key benefits we can provide include a single package approach with robust integrated solutions with primary side regulation and miniaturized form factors. For 10 to 50 watts, the key benefits of our solution include cost-effective design with separate control and power sections, a triac dimmable option, post regulation with dimming support, and no limitation to the number of LEDs on a string in your design. For 50 watts and above, the key benefits are efficiency higher than 91%, both with single stage and dual stage approach for AC-DC conversion, extended temperature range, and innovative zero voltage switching with resonant topology, which results in a very high efficiency, greater than 92%, with exceptionally small form factors. We also offer a solution with post regulation and a proprietary dimming approach. We also have a set of products for digital interfaces, remote controls, and diagnostics. There are three main solutions for non-isolated applications up to 10 watts, ideal for bulb replacement and lamp retrofit applications. They are buck, buck boost, and flyback topologies. For both monolithic converters used in the buck and buck boost configurations as shown, ST has the Viper family, which houses both the controller and the MOSFETs. Ultra-fast diodes are also available in a wide selection of packages and specifications. ST offers evaluation boards and the associated reference material based on the Viper Plus family for non-isolated topologies. They offer a small form factor and a simplified design, as well as high reliability while also being able to meet current energy saving regulations. The evaluation board ILL26V1 with its application note AN2961 provides a 3 watt non-isolated offline driver solution based on the Viper 22A low power offline switch mode power supply primary switcher. The circuit regulates the load current to 350 milliamps and generates about 10 volts. The load is composed of three high brightness LEDs connected in series. The ST Evaluation Board ILL17V1 with its application note AN2811 offers another non-isolated version based on a constant current source using the Viper 17HN which is the high frequency version. This solution operates with an AC line input range from 176 to 264 volts AC and provides 500 milliamps constant current with up to 7 volts DC. It can illuminate two LEDs in series. 
For non-isolated applications up to 20 watts, ST offers both inverse buck and buck boost configurations as shown based on the circuit with the L6562 PWM controller here. For the PWM controller, the L6562A provides the benefit of a high power factor. The MD Mesh 2 and Super Mesh 3 MOSFET technologies provide up to 800 volts with the best on resistance in the market, as well as low input capacitance and gate charge. Of course, ST also supports a wide selection of ultra-fast diodes in many packages and different parameters. Our evaluation boards with associated reference design material demonstrate the high power factors and high efficiency of these simple and low-cost solutions based upon the L6562A PWM controller. An 18-watt single-stage offline LED driver solution is implemented on the Steval ILL027V2 evaluation board using a buck boost converter topology with the L6562A. The converter operates with the constant peak current for constant power control in transition mode to achieve low switching losses. For this design, the LED string consists of up to 18 1 watt white LEDs in series and isolation is not required. The Steval ILL034V1 implements a non dimmable, non isolated LED driver solution that is small enough to fit inside the base of an A19 bulb outline. The coupled inductor has a step down winding to power the L6562A PFC driver. It supports a string of 5 to 12 LEDs with 370 milliamps output. For isolated applications up to 10 watts, and so for topologies including an isolation transformer, ST offers both an innovative primary side regulation solution and the conventional secondary side regulation as shown on the flyback schematics based on a single package approach. In the primary side regulation option, ST's HVLED805 embeds an 800 volt power MOSFET and an advanced PWM controller. This allows quasi-resonant zero voltage switching operation for improved efficiency. Its primary side constant current constant voltage regulation with 5% accuracy supports a new generation of LED lamps. In the secondary side regulation option, the Viper Plus family is combined with ST's advanced CVCC SEA0X device for very high efficiency. A wide range of Schottky diodes for secondary rectification completes ST's offer for this application. The innovative HVLED805 integrates a high-performance PWM LED controller with constant current and voltage primary sensing and an 800-volt avalanche rugged internal power MOSFET, as shown in the schematic. It results in higher reliability and is intended to operate directly from the rectified mains with minimal external parts in this typical LED interior lighting application. It is therefore perfectly suited for the new generation of LED retrofit lamps and also supports low power 8 to 5 watt AC-DC LED driver applications. It is housed in a small SO16 package and its primary side regulation provides 5% LED constant current accuracy and safe operation against open or shorted LED strings while avoiding the use of secondary sensing. In addition, no optocoupler is needed, so a lower cost and less complex solution can be designed. Finally, the HVLED 805's quasi-resonant operation reduces conduction and switching losses, and since it works at variable frequency, the EMI levels are reduced. ST offers two evaluation boards for the HVLED 805 with associated reference design material available on our website. The first demonstration board is the Eval HVLED805, which is a 4.2 watt offline LED driver with primary side regulation for 350 milliamp LED types. It can control from one to three LEDs with great accuracy. 
This converter is designed for quasi-resonant flyback converters, enabling very low turn-on losses and EMI emissions. The second board is the Steval ILL037V1, which provides 80% efficiency for 200 milliamp LED types. It implements a 3.2 watt wide range mains LED power supply to support from 3 to 5 LEDs for LED lamps. The Viper Plus family integrates the controller and 800 volt Avalanche rugged MOSFET and offers many solutions and benefits in a variety of packages. Our isolated flyback topologies with quasi-resonant operation provide for very high efficiency and low EMI. Our fixed frequency solutions for both isolated and non-isolated topologies with jittering reduce EMI. ST's latest Viper 3X devices provide up to 15 watts peak power. The Viper Plus family supports features such as an auto restart mode after every fault condition, providing over voltage, over current and overload protection, and over temperature protection with hysteresis. It also operates at high temperatures and has excellent low power supply standby consumption. To illustrate the Viper Plus family's capability in implementing an LED power supply module characterized by a high power factor, we have developed an evaluation board, the EVL VIP 277 WLED, with its associated application note AN3212. It provides 3.5 to 7 watts high power factor output for offline LED drivers in flyback configuration. This integrated, compact, and robust solution is also implemented without an electrolytic output capacitor. For isolated applications from 10 to 75 watts, such as tube lamp and bulb replacement, and even street lighting, ST offers a single-stage flyback topology option with high power factor for simple, reliable, and high-performance designs. Depending on your requirements, there are several ways to achieve your design goals. For the PWM or PFC controller, ST's L6562A also provides innovative triac dimmable operation as well as high power factor capability. The MOSFETs, fast switching diodes, and voltage and current control ICs with very low current consumption round out this solution. Next, we'll show you examples of these solutions. The L6562A supports requirements up to more than 80 watts and provides triac dimmable operation as well as high power factor capability. The 15 watt triac dimmable LED driver shown here uses the L6562A transition mode PFC controller driving a single stage PFC flyback power converter. It is demonstrated in the evaluation board Steval ILL016V2 along with application note AN2711. Reference material is also available as needed. This solution provides a low-cost driver for LEDs that is compatible with triac phase control dimmers and gives luminaire manufacturers a low-cost commonly available dimming option for home fixtures. A side benefit is that when not wired to a dimmer, the unit's power factor is 0.9. The physical design can be made small enough to power a PAR38 lamp having 65 watts equivalent lumination. ST also offers several more boards demonstrating solutions using the L6562A as a current mode PFC controller. Each satisfies the energy saving regulations with high efficiency while also offering high performance and flexibility, such as there being no limitation to the number of LEDs on a string due to the high output voltage supported. The evaluation boards we have range from the L6562A Constant Current Inverse Buck Driver module in the EVL6562A LED to a 35-watt wide-range high-performance flyback converter. Another evaluation board, the Steval ILL019V1, was developed to drive high-brightness RGGB LEDs. These are used to easily modify the color of the light, change the brightness, or implement additional lighting features,
while achieving significant energy savings in decorative lighting applications. This board implements an innovative solution for driving multiple RGGB LEDs where a high power factor, safety isolation, and individual regulation of LED brightness are required. The microcontroller on board allows the output channels to be independently controlled by four PWM signals, allowing the application users to set any color or create automatic color effects. Street lighting may require, according to customer needs, non-isolated topologies. To meet this goal, ST offers a dual-stage solution, including a front-end PFC in standard boost topology and an inverse buck topology for constant current regulation. The Steval ILL013V1 is an 80-watt offline LED driver intended for 350 milliamp, 700 milliamp, and 1 amp high brightness LEDs with dimming, which is ENN55015 and EN610032 compliant. It is a modified buck converter design that allows designers to cover a wide range of different LED systems using a single topology. A user manual describes the complete design, including the schematic and bill of materials. For single or multiple LED columns, the L6562AT with a resonant controller, such as the L6599AT, or a constant current controller where the L6562AT supports the inverse buck topology, can be used along with our power MOSFETs. These offer extended temperature ranges suitable for outdoor applications with no electrolytics for high reliability, zero voltage switching, and symmetrical topology for very high efficiency, greater than 92%, and post-regulation dimming. The EVL130STRLIG demonstrates the characteristics and features of a 130-watt solution tailored to an LED power supply specification for street lighting. This design, composed of two stages, a front-end PFC using the L6562AT and an LLC resonant converter based on the L6599AT, provides very high efficiency and wide input mains voltage operation from 85 to 305 volts AC and long-term reliability. Protection features were built in against overload, short circuit, and open loop on each stage or input voltages. The EVL130WSTRLIG and EVL130WSLEU can be combined with the EVL6562A LED constant current inverse buck driver in order to evaluate a complete solution for LED street lighting. In isolated applications of 75 watts or more, the L6564 is a great choice for the PFC controller. The L6564 offers improved performance and protection with respect to equivalent 8-pin transition mode PFC controllers and is ideal for use as a pre-regulator and a switch mode power supply for LED lighting. The 100-watt evaluation board, the EVL6564-100W, implements a 100-watt PFC pre-regulator. It also demonstrates continuous power on a regulated 400-volt rail from a wide-range mains voltage and provides for the reduction of the mains harmonics. In addition, it is designed to take into account full load operation in still air. For applications such as street lighting, where the L6564 may also be used, ST's other offerings that round out our solution include PFC MOSFETs in our MD Mesh 2 Super Junction or Super Mesh 3 technologies, boost diodes to increase the efficiency of the PFC, half bridge MOSFETs for increased switching efficiency, resonant controllers for optimized light load management and Schottky diodes for improved avalanche ruggedness. Another option for high-brightness LED-based applications is the L6585DE, also used in applications like street lighting. It integrates all the functions required to ensure correct operation of high-brightness LED power supplies. This combo chip generates more light from less energy 
and is compliant with major safety and power consumption regulations. The L6585DE1 chip solution implemented in the Steval ILL038V1 replaces two separate devices, a PFC and a resonant half-bridge controller, greatly reducing design time and complexity with lower costs while providing a flexible solution. As shown in the next slide, it provides a highly flexible solution when paired with the STM8 microcontroller. This next solution is based upon the STM8 8-bit microcontroller family. The STM8 provides outstanding levels of digital and analog performance combined with a high level of cost effectiveness. Implemented around a high-performance 8-bit core and a state-of-the-art set of peripherals, the STM8 microcontrollers are manufactured using an ST proprietary 130 nanometer embedded non-volatile memory technology. The Steval ILL031V1 demonstration board with associated reference materials and application note AN3151 presents a new digital approach to performing real average current control on an LED street lighting platform made possible by the STM8. This LED platform, developed on a DC-DC inverse buck converter, takes advantage of power switch control and conditioning signal circuitry for current sensing. It is implemented on a multi-string system up to 120 watts with independent current control. Two different kinds of dimming are implemented, linear, also called analog, and digital. The system can also be interfaced with Zigbee modules for remote control. Benefits of this design include low energy consumption, low maintenance, and a small and lightweight design. This solution can also be extended to many other segments. For example, ST now has solutions for a digital constant current controller for LED color mixing based on the STM8S that is used in shop and home lighting as well as multicolor lighting. In addition to the offline LED streetlight controllers, we would now like to highlight our solar LED streetlight controller reference design based on the STM32. Its purpose is to provide a cost-optimized and fully protected solution to provide control for solar energy storage and to manage the LED streetlight. The solar LED streetlight controller consists of an 80-watt battery charger and a 25-watt LED driver. During the daytime, when there is sufficient sunlight, the charger converts the electricity from the solar panel and charges the battery. At nighttime, the battery powers on the LED lamp as a street light. Some of the main features of the Steval ILL022V1 evaluation board include a maximum power point tracker, or MPPT, for efficiency from the solar panel for electricity conversion automatic day-night weather detection, and automatic battery-to-main switchover. It also provides for constant current control of the LED lamp, battery charger control, and full protection for the battery, LED lamp, and solar panel. ST also provides the associated reference material and the application note UM0512 to support and assist you. As highway lighting gets more complex, Cities are moving toward full smart street lighting applications to save energy. ST has the best solutions as shown for applications such as lamp drivers and controllers based on the STM8S with a PFC and resonant controller solution. For wired and wireless lamp communication modules, our STM32W Zigbee or STM32F standard microcontroller pairs with our RF-based I2C dual interface EEPROM, the M24LR64R. The Powerline networking chip, the ST7540, completes our wired network offer. ST's solution for district data concentrators employs a GPRS module as well. We at ST can support you in many ways, including solutions for your dimming level requirements, on-off timing, lamp failure detection, monitoring consumed energy, determining lamp burning hours, and control of the pole tilt. Some of the benefits of smart street lighting for both the lighting management companies and LED luminary manufacturers include 
reduced maintenance cost with real-time monitoring of the lamp status, which results in more cost-effective maintenance scheduling. In case of a failure, there is no need for roving inspection. Also, there are energy savings, as you can dim or brighten lights according to a preset schedule or weather conditions or special events, thereby reducing greenhouse gas emissions as energy use is optimized. Finally, you have higher community satisfaction, as energy and maintenance savings allow public funds to be allocated toward other programs. Here, we present our power MOSFETs as they are a key component in many offline LED lighting and general illumination configurations, such as Buck and Buck Boost for non-isolated applications up to 20 watts, Flyback for isolated configurations from 10 to 75 watts, Resonant Converters for isolated applications greater than 75 watts, and for Power Factor Corrector Pre-Regulators. The table provides the breakdown voltage, maximum on resistance, or RDS on, and packaging available in ST's advanced power technology. The MD Mesh 2 is ST's second generation super junction high voltage power MOSFET technology, which features lower on resistance and lower switching losses than previous generations. It has been optimized to provide higher power density at lower cost. Our SuperMesh 3 technology covers our high-voltage breakdown class and provides improved avalanche ruggedness, even lower on-resistance, enhanced dynamic performance, and improved diode reverse recovery characteristics. To conclude, ST has a wide knowledge base to support energy-efficient solutions for LED lighting and general illumination. ST's LED lighting brochure is available on our website. It includes a summary of our evaluation boards, along with more detailed block diagrams and material to support your design efforts. In addition, ST has a design tool called eDesign Studio. It provides LED driver simulations to test LED offline, ACDC, and DCDC requirements. This tool simplifies power supply design and offers designers the flexibility to choose the right products and topologies. It also generates a full design from your high-level requirements and provides all relevant parameters and results, a full and interactive schematic, a full and interactive bill of materials, and a full set of analysis diagrams. This allows you to fine-tune your tentative design by adding more advanced constraints for stability and component selection. Finally, we are adding more content every day to our LED applications web pages to reinforce our local sales support. In addition to the block diagrams, data sheets, and application notes for the many design solutions discussed in this presentation, you will also find reference design material with detailed schematics, Gerber files, and bills of material. This concludes our presentation. Thank you for your time. We look forward to supporting you with ST's products and solutions for your LED-based design projects.